Paul's iOS device is a proud supporter of the National Campaign Against Drunk Driving. Hello ladies and gentlemen, Paul here with Paul's iOS device and I'm here to show you how to jailbreak the latest version of iOS, iOS 6.1.2 that Apple just released to the public. And first thing you need to do is obviously head to evasion.com. The O is a zero, by the way, and select the version for your machine. I'm selecting Mac OS X. If you're running a Windows machine, once you've downloaded it, you need to right click on the application and select run as an administrator. And then once your device is plugged in, make sure the tool recognizes your device and then select jailbreak. I've, I've sped this up considerably, as you can see here. Now it's uploading Cydia packages lists. Again, be patient, don't touch anything. Here pretty soon, it's gonna tell you to continue, please unlock your device, and then head to the jailbreak application. So I'm gonna to slide to unlock here. Head over to the jailbreak application and just tap it once. And let it crash. Again, don't touch anything now. Now that it's remounting and injecting the remount payload, We're almost done. Be patient. The root file system and preparing the final jailbreak data. And then here pretty soon it's going to tell you that the jailbreak is complete. But it is really not complete. Your device is now going to finish off the jailbreak with a couple reboots. And now it's going to be cleaning up the file system and continuing to boot. Now it's going to head to the lock screen. Again, don't touch. Once it heads to the second lock screen, it's going to go blank and then the lock screen will come right back up. Now you can go ahead and slide to unlock. Let's go ahead and slide to unlock once. I'm just going to let it time out and then turn it back on just to be 100% 100% sure. Okay, turn my device on and slide to unlock. And now you've got the Cydia icon. Go ahead and select that. Now it's going to prepare the file system. I've sped this up considerably for your convenience. Now it's going to reboot or respring. It's going to head back to the lock screen, slide to unlock. And now you'll have a completely working Cydia icon. You're going to select user, hacker, or developer. And if you don't know which one to select, down below tells you what each one contains. I usually select developer because it contains the most, but the majority of jailbreakers select user. Now City is going to load and you're up and running on version 6.1.2. Hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it helped you out. Go ahead and update to version 6.1.2 because this is a working untethered jailbreak. And I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, pound that like button down below and that subscribe button down below that really helps me out. Thanks for watching. This is Paul. God bless.